the whole album of the boy with no name is uh, a complete misfire. record company were like we want more singles we want more singles and they just kept whipping us and whipping us and we were just making singles and singles and singles to the point where we'd finished the album the last day in the studio and we got a call from the record company we need three more songs like what the fuck but what? and so we to me it's just a it was just a, an album that was written for the record company, there, there are so okay. there are loads of great songs on it. That's the thing. That's the, the saving grace of the album. Mm -hmm. There are many, many good songs on it. But for me, it's just left a bad taste. It's the only album that's left a kind of bad taste in my mouth. I really, really, really understood. So here's the thing. What to Jay Smith is a good record. It's um. It was like our bachelor bachelor record though. Mm -hmm. Came off the record deal. We went into a studio for two weeks and wrote it in two weeks. Then we recorded it in two weeks. That was the project, that was the idea. Yeah. Let's um let's do this, let's try and do something that we haven't done before and see what happens. I would never do that again. I didn't I felt that to write it in two weeks and then record it, you didn't have time to reflect on anything. Okay. I would have taken about 90% of that album, I would have put in the bin. I really like um, Ode to Jay Smith. I'm um, sorry, Jay Smith, the song. Yeah, the song yeah. I think that's a really great moment of recording. Sure, with the choir. And yeah, and the, yeah. The, the, the shortness of it, and the, there's so much in it. Yeah. I remember playing it to Ryan Adams. Oh, yeah. He came into the studio when we were in New York, and I was like, sit down. And he was like, and played him that song. And he, he was like, at the end of it, because it's weird. It's just weird yeah, shit. Sure.